I'm sure you've answered multiple choice questions before, right? It's a really common task type. Because of that, some people think it's easy, but it can be a bit tricky. Here's some information about this question type. This is what a multiple choice question looks like. As you can see, there's a question or an unfinished sentence followed by three possible answers, A, B or C. Now, only one of these answers is correct. The possible answers may be a paraphrase of what is said in the conversation. In other words, it's the same thing said in a different way. Once you think you know the answer, and especially during answer transfer time, it's important to write your answer in the right place on the answer sheet. Just the letter A, B or C is enough. Here is another multiple choice question type that you sometimes encounter in the IELTS listening test. In this variation of the task, the question or unfinished sentence is followed by a longer list of possible answers and you have to choose more than one answer. Make sure you read the instructions carefully so you know how many answers you're supposed to choose. Once again, it's important to write your answers in the right place on the answer sheet. In this example, you'll need to write two letters from the options A, B, C, D or E in the spaces for questions 1 and 2. So you've probably done lots of multiple choice questions before, but are you doing them efficiently? Here are some tips for how to do this task. OK, the first thing you should do is read the instructions carefully to see how many answers you need to find. So in this example, we need to find one answer. Now, you'll have some time to read the questions first before you listen. Look at the question stem. That's this part here. And underline keywords like this. Listen out for these words as they'll help to guide you during the listening. Look at the options too and think about how these could be paraphrased or said in a different way. For example, instead of sports counsellor, the speakers might say advisor to sports people. During the test, listen for keywords like these. They will help you find the answer. By the way, the answers are always in text order. So, for example, you will hear the speakers giving the answer for question one near the beginning of the listening text. Listen and choose the answer that has the same meaning as the one that is given in the listening text. So, if you try to follow this strategy, you should find doing multiple choice in the listening a little easier. Here's a written summary of all these tips.